Hi everyone, my name is Luis Martello. I'm a Dennis Week artist and I am Portuguese, but I'm based in England, um, United Kingdom. Today I'm here to show you my first ever mute when I was a child. And I will tell you the many options uh, you can have with this mute. And it's the famous cup mute, the Dennis Week adjustable cup mute. You can adjust the mute just here and that's it many many options um, many different things you can do and that's why in Portugal I remember my band my my local band used to buy them because we could have uh, an all-in-one mute uh, at a very very good price um, so let's try it so this is the cup mute right I'm gonna play a melody that everyone knows um, and then I will play it with the different uh, possibilities on the mute so this is my Dennis Week Heritage 3C mouthpiece very beautiful and this is the song And now let's play it with the cup mute first. Right, so this is the cup mute at the end of the mute. The cup at the end of the mute. And now I will move it a bit up. And I will get a darker sound and less volume. Right? And now even more. But not closing it. Really, really closing it at all just a little bit there this is amazing in the same mute you can have so many different uh, things and for instance just to tell you I have the practice mute from Dennis Week right and I did a video about this a while ago and I will play just for you and some people doesn't like um, practice mute but with this mute you have the option of closing the old cup and it will keep the intonation it will be much more free blowing than any practice mute and is all in one again you can buy only one mute if you don't have the budget to buy them all and this is where it starts coming becoming very interesting the mute can be used you take the cup out and you have a fantastic straight mute. Beautiful. And then we could stop here. A lot of people, these ones I told you now, everybody that has this mute, uh, who has this mute, uh, does that. But then comes what I started doing. I needed a plunger, right? And I didn't have a plunger. I didn't have money to buy a plunger. So I started using the cup like this on the concert. So I used to put it on the floor like this. So if I needed a, a straight mute, I had it. And if I needed a plunger, I will take it. And as it is closed, it's closed there as you can see of course because the bottom is there
right? Another option, if I wanted a more open um, plunger, I used to use my fingers a bit open like that, just holding the cup, opening a bit of the fingers, not too much, or adjusting according to the sound that I'm looking for. 